Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. It's the man, the myth, the legend. It's Ben. Today is going to be more of a different kind of video, more of a quote unquote inspirational slash sad slash depressing slash I don't have any video ideas, so I'm just going to do shit that I got in my mind. Um, and this is just an overall general topic to, you know, any kind of age group, but I'm more leading it on like the, the older. Um, group of people because I feel like this is a problem with a lot of people and it's a problem with me I'm not gonna lie you know <sighs> you guys have been asking me to do face cam ever since you know day one of me doing live streams and such and, you know I used to do them a lot that's when I really didn't care about what I looked like or something like that <laughs> but now it sucks because you know the reason why I don't do face cam anymore is because I'm so insecure and just disgusted with the way I look. And it's honestly repulsive how I could hate myself for something I can't help. You know, and that's why you guys can't hate yourselves for what you look like. And I know this isn't everybody, but there are people that just hate everything about themselves. And for what? Just because somebody else doesn't like you for who you are and what you look like? You can't help that. Nobody can. It's what you were destined to be. And you know what? You're beautiful in your own way. We're all beautiful. You know? Well, on the outside, you've heard this a million times from a million other people. But what, what's on the outside really doesn't fucking matter, you know? And, you know, and the thing, the thing is, you know, uh, this is going to go straight into a ton of different topics because I just really need to rant about this, you know? I feel like this is the place I need to go where I need to rant about something. But... The mentality that, that is, a relationship will make me happy. A relationship will get all of my problems away. You know, that is such bullshit. You don't understand. It's so fucking stupid how people think that. Relationships are just like cutting, drinking, all this bullshit. But it's so, it, it all ends so much worse than... Oh, it makes the pain that you were experiencing before ten times harder and unbelievably, like, I intolerable. And it sucks because people just have that insane mentality that, oh, I have a boyfriend or a girlfriend or whatever. And they just, all of a sudden, they're like, oh, I'm happy now. But deep inside, they're not happy. You know, a relationship only numbs the pain. Just like cutting only numbs the pain. You know, I'm not going to lie to you guys. I've cut a lot, you know, if that's with a shard of glass or a knife or something, whatever. But it doesn't help. It's not in the moment. It's okay, you know. You're feeling something other than emotional pain, and that's the worst kind of pain anybody can feel. Ever. There's nothing worse. And I wouldn't know any other kind of, like, physical pain, you know. But I know... And I'm sure you guys do too. Mental pain is the worst fucking thing you'll ever experience in your life. You know, because it always sticks with you. It won't go away. You know. And just uh, look around you. There are so many different people. And it's not just like... Uh, there's so much more than just what you can see with your eyes, you know. It's what you take in. With, what you, with your ears, with your soul even. Just what you think about another person means so much, you know. When I see a person or a car or a house, you know, I just don't think like, oh, look at that. It's another house, you know. I think about the people's lives and like what they experience on a day-to-day -day basis, what they're like, you know. Just because somebody's qualified as ugly or pretty or beautiful or something like that, that doesn't mean any fucking thing at all. You'd be the ugliest person of all fucking time. That doesn't fucking matter, you know? This world isn't about what you look like. It's what you do. And what you do for other people and yourself. You have to love yourself because nobody's going to be with you your entire life. Nobody. Nobody. Not your mom, not your dad, not your... Not any fucking buddy. You are going to be with you all the time. Every fucking minute of your life. It's you. And if you're stuck with somebody you fucking hate... What's the point of living, you know? And honestly, I I've been, like, sincerely suicidal, you know? I'm... If I had a chance that long ago to end it, I probably would have. I'm not trying to sound emo or fucking stereotypical, but 
honestly, I probably would have ended my life. And, you know, I don't want pity for that. I don't want, oh, bang, oh, I'm happy you didn't kill yourself. You know, I am too. Because, personally, myself, I have not experienced even the, mo the, s the smallest bit of life. Because I'm in school right now. I'm in high school. That's not fucking life. School is not life. Because when you get out into the quote-unquote real world, you'll see... That it's nothing like school. Not a single bit like school. The only thing school will actually teach you that you will use every single day is social skills. And that's not even every day. I'm sure one or two days, yeah, you'll talk to somebody. But you'll go on hours on end, days, weeks even, without talking to a single person. You know, I do that, you know. This coming summer, I'm not going to talk to anybody but you guys. And I, I can't fucking wait, personally, because, you know what, I'm really starting to get back in the, the groove of, you know, love yourself before you love anybody. Because, in all reality, it doesn't matter. The only person that matters, it might sound selfish, but you know what, some people need to be fucking selfish, you know. Because their whole life, they've just been selfless, you know. Always wanting to help other people. And that's why I think everybody needs to do. Just help other people, you know. Don't hate or hurt people for being less than you. You know, you're with you forever. Nobody else is, you know. I mean, maybe you have a parent or something that's with you until the day you die. But there's always moments where you're completely alone, stuck with your own thoughts. And it's, sometimes it's horrific, some of the stuff you can think of by yourself, what you want to do to yourself. But then think about it again. You're the only person you got. You are the only support for you. You know? You are you. That's, that's basically it, you know? It might sound cliche or stupid, you know? But without you, you're nothing. If you have a girlfriend that's there for you every day, like, Oh, hey, what's up, dude? You know? That's beautiful, you know? Honestly, I support that. But nine times out of ten, it's not going to end pretty. You know? And in most cases, nobody's going to be on your side when you break up with her or she breaks up with you. You know? You only have you to get you through that. You only have you to get you th through anything in life. People will come and help numb the pain or maybe take a couple, you know, <laughs> moments away from reality. But just because you have a boyfriend or girlfriend, like I said before, Nothing's going to change. You might feel a little bit of happiness. People don't make you happy. You make you happy. You're the only fucking person that can do it. Yeah, it might be nice to have somebody that's more than a friend or even just a friend. Some people don't have any fucking buddy, and they're the happiest motherfuckers I've ever seen. And some people have tons of people. Tons. But they still find something to just... I don't know, it's it's so confusing because you think, yeah, people make me happy. But then 95% of your life, you'll be sitting there alone, talking to nobody but yourself in your head. And if you hate what you're thinking of, if you hate everything about yourself, what's that going to lead to? More self-hate? More re You're going to have to rely on people more than ever. And you know, when they're not there, it's just going to get worse and worse and worse. And that's going to lead to suicide. And you know what? It's not fucking worth it. No matter what anybody fucking says. It's a fucking coward's way out. Alright? If any of you guys need help, I know a lot of you guys are fucking jokesters and pranksters and shit. But seriously, if you guys need any kind of help with anything, I, DM me on Snapchat, Twitter, or whatever. The video was a bit of a tangent. I don't know where I was going with it. Um, Please leave me video ideas. I'm going to start getting into school videos and what I think about school and the school system and shit. i um, running out of time because, once again, I don't know how to fucking edit for shit, man, you know? But I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please, just just love yourself. That's all you need to do.